And here's the show star, it's our own Steve Parr. Confederate Army General was Robert E. Who. Michelle, yes. And I think everybody who comes on, you know, feels inside that they're going to be the one that, you know, goes on anyway. I think everybody has that sort of secret confidence inside, or that hope anyway. So what's your ambition in terms of the show? Well, right from the first, we said, wouldn't it be wonderful if we got the car. <laughs> It's Monday morning at the Avalon Television Studios and preparations are underway for filming another five episodes of Sale of the Century. Michelle Patterson Grace is running hot. At last Monday's recording session, she won five games in a row and needs at least another two to get that car. If she loses, she loses the lot. You see people who've been on for five nights and they start buying lots of gift shops. You almost feel like saying, don't buy it, you won't win, you know? What you're up against. The whole thing just has that unreal feeling I was talking about before. It just goes the whole way through. You know, you don't really feel as if there are people next to you. You're just in this little bubble by yourself pressing your, pressing your buzzer. After a final rehearsal, last minute adjustments, a computer check, and of course the most important rehearsal of all... One, two, three, let's all go together. Here we go. It's time to get on with the show. White and what other colour appear on the national flag of Italy? Sharon. Green. Yes. Who delivered the Sermon on the Mount? Wow, she's done it! Michelle has done it! She's done it! Oh, with a score of 55. Oh, well, that was pretty scary, that one. You didn't get tempted to take the trip instead of coming back for the car? No, right from the first we really wanted the car, you know, yeah. it was the car that... That was the prize that we were going for. So, as Ken waits nervously in the wings, it's a quick <laughs> costume change for Michelle, two new contestants, and this round, she's taking no yeah, chances. You, what kind of living thing is Rosemary? Carol. Herb. Yes. What? That's it. She's done it. She's done it. With a score of 80, our champ is Michelle. Like all good stories, a happy ending. And this Cinderella gets to keep the coach.